Church Wilm Reservoir is the latest example. Commemorating 60 years of British military aviation, a World War I SE-5D fighter on its way to take off for the Royal Flying Corps' Jubilee. Wing Commander Bates in authentic First World War flying gear. The SE-5 was as important to the First World War as the Spitfire was to the Second. Top-ranking RAF officers were there to see the SE-5 go through her paces again with former Chief of Air Staff Sir Dermot Boyle. The display brings back memories of the days when pilots were only kept from disaster by piano wire and a good engine. The Royal Flying Corps started in 1912. Later, it was amalgamated with the Royal Naval Air Service to become the Royal Air Force. This film from Movie Tone's library shows the SE-5 in its original setting. The Bristol fighter was used to protect bombers like the Handley Pay. Those magnificent young men by their fighting machines were a rare breed and the planes, by modern standards, were flying miracles. Today, it's a far cry from canvas and piano wires at the Hanover Air Show. The